part because they've used it and recently the Singapore Prime Minister used it to show the rapid growth of new media like broadcasting to deal with this phenomenon the council gave several suggestions one is electronic engagement urging the government to intensify its communication with Singaporeans using new media like blogs increasingly you know uh, political discourse is going to take place online there's no running away from the fact that the new media is an important channel of communication is an important uh, tool for politicians you know to attract support to raise funds on regulating online political content it suggested narrowing the law or even revoking it that was controversial because some of us were in favor of uh, repeal of the provision others wanted a more nuanced view uh, relating to amendment uh, and were not prepared to go quite as far as this the committee admitted it did not cover all the issues concerning new media and that's because they were focusing more on those that are time sensitive but going forward, the committee says the government needs to pay attention to other issues like the protection of private information on the internet as well as copyrights. And for those who think the committee's recommendations are still too conservative? I'd rather be right than be radical. An independent current affairs website hopes bloggers will analyse the report and give feedback. I don't think we should be waiting and waiting for the government necessarily to give us a stamp of approval before we start moving forward and doing some work ourselves. You can give your feedback at this website address. The council will submit the recommendations to the government by November.